Guys and Dolls is about a bunch of gamblers who fall in love with a bunch of dancers who break up and then they get married. <laughs> Guys and Dolls was about a bunch of gamblers that were gambling and getting chased by cops. And they shouldn't have been doing it. Okay, I'm done now. Guys and Dolls is about, is the story of, of a, a group of gamblers who, um, one, one has a fiance who doesn't want him to gamble. I, I say it's a pretty bad thing too. Um, and they get over fights about it and they're running from the police who are telling, or saying it's illegal. Guys and Dolls is a, about a very confusing marriage with gamblers, prayers, and dancers, and I like the play. So Guys and Dolls was about, like, so there was this Nathan Detroit guy who's the main character. He wanted to gamble, but his wife, quote-unquote, didn't want him to, and, like, at the end they got married, and you guys did great performing the play. Guys and Dolls is about a group of gamblers that are just gambling, or, uh, okay, can I restart? Uh, or that are just gambling, and then, um, one guy has a fiance, and then, um, he backstabbed, or, like, he backstabbed, uh, uh, never mind, can I retry? I didn't think that's, uh, Okay. Show must go on. And then um, he keeps on gambling, and then at the end he gets married. Guys and Dolls was technically a, um, a show where um, it was about a group of gamblers that um, were betting over women, and um, um, Nathan Detroit's fiance didn't want him to keep gambling. So, but he still did it, and they broke up, got married for some reason, and yeah. <laughs> Guys and Dolls is about a whole bunch of gamblers who, oh, can I restart? Guys and Dolls, oh, shoot. I, I don't want to restart. Guys and Dolls are about, is about, a group of gamblers and they like to gamble. My favorite part about it is when they all are running from the police. Guys and Dolls is an awesome movie about a guy who gambles but his fiance doesn't want him to. It's full of surprises and great songs and I thank Pierce for putting on it. My favorite part of Guys and Dolls was when they, um, so basically it was kind of confusing. So, like, they said that they're done with the guys, and then, the, um, Adeline says, Let's marry them. I think that that was kind of funny, kind of a weird twist. My favorite part of Guys and Dolls was when they did gambling in the mission, and then the police found. And then, like, they were running from, like, the police, I think. And, like, Nathan was like, oh, and, like, oh, we gotta get out. And then he got the money, and then I forgot the other dude's name, but he just came and picked up the money. That was my favorite part. My favorite part was when the guy kept standing up in the mission and saying, like, I agree, I agree, and everyone started yelling, shh. Uh, my favorite part with Guys and Dolls was when they were um, gambling in the sewer, I think it was, because they opened up like the sewer. And then uh, when the guy, uh, gambler from Chicago, got punched in the face. That was my favorite part. My favorite part was when Adley was sneezing like, Achoo! My favorite part was when um, he punched the guy out of the way when they were gambling. My favorite part of Guys and Dolls is when the gamblers were down, down in the sewer gambling. My favorite part of the play Guys and Dolls is when the hot box 
chick chick chickies or whatever they were called i forget came out they had a really cool choreographed dance that i liked can you do a little bit of their dance no. can you give a little wiggle My favorite part of Guys and Dolls was when they were at the the gamblers were at the Save Us Soul mission, and the and Sky said life is just a big crap game, and then the guy from Chicago was like, "Crap game where?" My favorite part about Guys and Dolls when that the girls had that dance. I don't know what they were called. I don't know, but I. They had a really good routine, and they were all together, and it was really cool. Yeah. My favorite part of Guys and Dolls is when the both of the girls say, change them tomorrow, marry them today. My favorite part of Guys and Dolls was when the two girls, Adelaide and Miss Sarah, were saying, they're so whatever, and they they want nothing to do with them and then like 30 seconds later let's marry them it was funny my favorite part of guys and dolls is when Adelaide and her friends go and dance at a diner my favorite part was when they sung the, the song about how like I live you a bushel and a peck like that I like that part can you sing it for us no. Okay. This is my best impression of Sarah Brown. I can never love someone who's a gambler. <laughs> this is my best impersonation of Adelaide. It's okay, honey. I like it when you forget my present. It makes me feel like we're married. <laughs> This is my best impersonation of Adelaide. A person can develop a cold. A oh, this is my impression of Sarah. What is this? We should give this to the kids that don't like milk. Uh, this is my best impersonation of Nathan Detroit. I found a place for the crop game, but they wants one hundred grand. Uh, they wants one grand, and I don't got that. This is my best impersonation of Sky Masters. All right, I'll bet a thousand bucks you can't get this right. Am I left-handed or am I right-handed? I'll give you a hint. This is my best impersonation of Sarah Brown. I can never love someone who's a gambler. This is my best impersonation of Nathan Detroit. Boys, I found a crap place for the crap game. But we have to pay one thousand dollars. This is my best impersonation of Nicely Nicely. Hey Nathan, have you found a place for the crap game yet? This is my best impersonation of Nicely Nicely. Nicely Nicely. This is my best impression of Nathan Detroit. <laughs> impression of Nathan Detroit. Sue me, sue me, what could you do me? I love you. I love you. <laughs> <laughs> this is my best impersonation of Sarah. <clears throat> Brothers and sisters, come join us. Uh, your souls need replenishing. This is my best impersonation of Big Jewelry. Crap game? Where? This is my best Big Jewelry impersonation. That is a lie! <laughs> uh, I'm, this is my best impersonation of Big Jewelry. Uh, I want a crap game. Crap game, crap game, crap game. <laughs> my best impression of Adeline. Come on, girl! <laughs> <laughs> this is my best Adeline impersonation. Impress... How do you say that word? Impersonation. impersonation. Oh, Nathan! Achoo! Ow! Oh, 
God, that hurt. <laughs> this is my best Adelaide impression. Don't tell me you're doing the crap game again. This is my best impression of Adelaide. I love you. A bushel in a peck. A bushel in a peck. And a hug around the neck. <laughs> this is my best impersonation of Adeline. A poison can develop a <laughs> This is my best Nathan Detroit impersonation. Guys, we gotta find a place for a crap game. Hi, this is my best imp impression of Sarah Brown. Brothers, sisters, join us. This is my best Sky Masterson impersonation. Life is just a big crap game. <laughs> this is my best impression of Adelaide. Honey, are you gambling? <laughs> <laughs>